go to the ref, get my refund status on their website and all it tells you is that it's still being processed. Tax refund delays are completely out of control right now. Calling appears to be pointless and is mostly automated and checking your status on irs.gov only shows you if your tax return has been received by the IRS but does not tell you why your tax refund is delayed. So in this video, I'm gonna go over my top 10 reasons why your refund is delayed this year. And please comment below if your refund is delayed or if your refund status changes so we can get through this together. Also, go ahead and like this video for me as it helps others see it on YouTube and subscribe if you wanna see more content like this. Okay, let's jump into the reasons why your refund is delayed. First up, the IRS is backlogged by millions. If you didn't know, as of June 23rd, 2021, the IRS had 17.5 million unprocessed individual returns that have not been reviewed yet. This includes returns received prior to 2021 that needs to be manually reviewed because of error. Heck, in fact, not too long ago, paper tax returns filed for 2019 tax year were being stored in trailers until they could be looked at. And now the IRS says that due to the global outbreak, they are seeing delays in the processing of tax returns filed on paper and electronically, delays in live phone support, and delays in answering any mail sent by taxpayers. To help, they are rerouting tax returns and taxpayer correspondence from locations that are behind to locations where more staff is available. But as of now, they are still behind and are being processed in the order received. Next, errors on your return. Another reason your refund may be delayed is due to errors. Think like mathematical mistakes, forgetting to sign your return, or forgetting to include your social security number can all contribute to a delay. When errors occur, the return must be reviewed manually. Next, direct deposit accounts don't match up. When your bank account does not match up with the information on your return, your refund is sure to be delayed. Common mistakes include ownership of the bank account not matching with the filing status or name of the return and mistakes in your routing and account numbers. If this is the case, one of three things can happen. First, if the mistake does not pass the IRS validation criteria, you will be issued a paper check instead. Number two, if the mistake does pass the IRS validation criteria, but the bank rejects the refund, you will receive a paper check. And number three, if the mistake is accepted by the bank, you may have to talk with your bank to get your money back. Next, identity theft or fraud is suspected. Yup, criminals may be behind your refund delay. The IRS flagged 5.2 million tax refunds for fraud last year, which is almost 50% more than in 2019. Of those, 1.9 million were tagged for identity screening. You see, the IRS has filters that can identify potentially fraudulent returns. When the filter does stop a return, refunds can be delayed until you verify your identity by providing the IRS with information regarding current and previous returns or verify your income via W-2s. Sometimes that verification process can take upwards of a year to clear up. Income discrepancy. The IRS receives every single W-2 and 1099 that you receive. When the information you file does not match up with the information the IRS already has, it can cause a delay in you receiving your refund. In fact, any form of earned income you receive should be reported even if you do not receive any other forms for it. Unemployment Benefits Exclusion on March 11th, a change to the American Rescue Plan allowed taxpayers who earn less than $150,000 in modified adjust gross income to exclude unemployment compensation up to $20,400 if married filing jointly and $10,200 for all other eligible taxpayers. The IRS has determined that 13 million people may be eligible for the adjustment. The problem is that some people already filed their taxes before the legislation was put into place, which means the IRS now has to fix the issue for those who included the unemployment compensation in their income. And to do so, the IRS is automatically adjusting it, but you can bet that it's adding to the delay. The recovery rebate credit doesn't match. For those who didn't receive all the stimulus payments they were eligible for in 2020, you can get a recovery rebate credit 
when you filed your 2020 tax return. Some people are incorrectly filling out that line and claiming the incorrect amount on the form 1040. If you fall into this category, the IRS says that they will have to review your return manually, which will further delay your refund. Incorrectly claiming dependents. It's quite common that young adults forget to check with their parents to see if the parents are claiming them on their tax return before filing their own, or that two parents end up claiming the same child. When someone takes their own exemption while simultaneously is claimed as a dependent, or when two people claim the same child as a dependent, the IRS stops refunds until an amended return is filed. Past due returns. When you fail to file previous returns, your refund can be delayed until you file the past due return. Additionally, if any taxes are owed, the IRS will use your current refund and deduct the amount of past due taxes. Filed by mail. Filing your return by mail is the fastest way to delay your refund because the mail takes more time to get to the IRS and paper returns take longer to process, including longer to catch any errors. Remember, the IRS has 17.5 million unprocessed individual returns that have not been reviewed yet, which includes returns received prior to 2021 that needs to be manually reviewed because of error. Well, there you have it, my top 10 reasons why your refund is delayed. Let me know in the comments if your refund is delayed. If you found this video helpful, do me a favor and hit that like button for me. It helps others find this video on YouTube. And subscribe to the channel for more content like this. I'm Karan from Life Accounting. Until next time.